told if I'm, uh, we'll totally get this done. Should I do it? So I'm going to go into my, my Macintosh hard drive, find my username really quick, and go to my downloads so I can open the red stuff. Okay, it's right here, Redstone. All the links are in the description. This is going to be the same for PC and and um, Mac. Sorry, I'm trying to multitask and install Pandora to show you that it is multitasking enabled. But, um, you're going to browse for your ISPW. I mean, IPSW, sorry. Got it wrong. Okay, so you go to, um, you, you, if you're on a Mac, you go right here. You need name. Library. You scroll down and find iTunes. There it is, iTunes, iPhone software update. So this is only going to be there if um, you restored your iPhone via iTunes, which you're going to want to do. You're just going to plug your iPhone in, it's going to start up, you're going to press restore, and it's going to do this. Back up all your data before you do this, it's going to delete everything. But, okay, anyways, you click this right here. It says processing firmware, as you can see. See if it does it. Okay, it says successfully identified, and you click next. I don't know if this is going to work because my iPhone is not plugged in because I've already done this, already completed this, but okay, it did. So you're going to click all of it. Um, even if you want to hacktivate, don't click anything else besides what's already enabled. Um, if you don't want the battery percentage, yada yada, you don't got to click it, you can unclick it. If you have custom boot logos, I'm pretty sure you know what to do. And uh, you just click next, and then you turn. You just turn um, your iPhone off and follow the steps to go into DFU mode, and then um, I think you're done. It fully loads. You get the little pineapple on your screen. Or no, first you get the little hard drive with the green arrow pointing down. It's gonna do that. It's gonna take about I'd say five to ten minutes maybe to fully do it and then uh, you'll be done. Your iPhone will reboot automatically. You're going to want to open Cydia. I'll switch cameras really quick. I'll switch to my camera so you can see it. Okay. This is going to show you how to unlock it. You're just going to go to Cydia. It's going to load up. It's going to take a while. For you, since you just finished jailbreaking, it's going to reload the data. You're going to want to wait that whole time until it's completely done and it turns off and then comes back on. And then you're going to want to click on changes and do all the upgrades. It's very, very important. You don't want your iPhone not to be upgraded or whatever. Okay, mine's loading data as you can see. Okay, it's loading. I usually let it finish loading, otherwise it kind of lags. And okay, I won't, for demonstration purposes, I won't wait for it to load. But you're going to go to manage. And the source is already going to be installed, so you're just going to go to manage, click sources. And then it's going to be under repo666.ultrasnow.com. You're going to click that. And then you're going to press install. You're going to wait for it to finish. It's going to tell you to reboot your iPhone. So you're going to want to do that and uh, reboot it. You're going to put your SIM in while it's rebooting if you want but put it in before it starts loading the Apple. Otherwise, you're going to put your SIM in after it's done, turn your iPhone off, and then back on. And uh, you should be set for T-Mobile. Enable MMS. Here's, I'm going to do a quick little tutorial on how to enable MMS for you guys. You're going to go to General, network sell your, your data network and then it's going to come up with this whole list of stuff and um i'll put everything in the in the in the box below so you guys can get everything ready and everything will be set all right guys i think that's about it you guys have fun all links are in the description everything's in the description thanks all right everybody um Sorry for the horrible mic quality and the horrible video quality. Me not really keeping my iPhone in the in the area that it needed to be in. Um, but if you guys have any problems with this, send me an at Twitter message at Z O M F G Aaron. I'll post it in the video and um, 
If you have any problems, get to me there, or you can message me on YouTube. Um, yeah, if you guys have any problems, just message me. If you have any questions, message me. I'll keep updating videos. This is my first one, but I've been doing this for year, like two years now. Um, Alright, thanks.